Okay, I'm going to do a little trailer maintenance before I take a long uh, trip with the trailer. Uh, one thing you're going to want to do is check your grease fittings. And I'll show you on the other wheel because I have it off. Another thing you're going to want to do is make sure all five of these are snug on all the wheels. I mean, more than snug, tight. Um, you want to check all these because sometimes they can get loose when you hit something or move. So anyway, to get to your grease fitting... Um, and I use, and, and the, the manufacturer recommended on this particular trailer, anyway, you basically just stick your fingernail in there, a small screwdriver, and pull this out. Um, then, hopefully you can see in there, let me put on a glove. Then you're just going to look for the small grease fitting, which is up top, right there. Uh, it's not focusing well, but anyway. And you can see this can use a little bit of grease. I don't like to pack them all the way to the edge or then all the grease gets all around in here. And these do have brakes and it's not good to get them all up on your brakes. And um, again, Lucas, I use Lucas grease. This is the red and tacky. It is a load right trailer and that's what load right recommended. You can get Lucas in the Marine, but I would just um, stick with the Lucas red and tacky and fill those up and then put the cap back on it'll look like that obviously check all your air pressure tires check the air pressure in your um your spare and just little walk arounds make sure you have two license plate bolts on tight i only have one there i gotta fix that and that's about it hopefully this trailer oh, obviously all your lights and hopefully she's ready to roll i'm gonna put a um a few thousand miles on her right.